push those hips back. All right, don't worry about trying to, I know you're trying to like go and like do this kind of stuff. Just pretend there's a piece of paper on the floor and you're trying to rip it. Now push your hips back to pull. Don't lean, just do, do, do pelvic tilt. Yeah, that'll pull this muscle out, right? Just from here. So you want to be from here. So like a... Yeah, yeah anterior, anterior, anterior pelvic tilt. Anterior pelvic tilt. Yeah, and then flex. Now bring these up more. There you go. Good. And up. Front lat, Feel relax. Good, now let's be strong here. Like, let's not be laziness, strong. Yeah, there you go. Corner turn. Tight glutes. Look straight. Gonna learn to lean forward a little bit. There you go. Push your shoulder down and over. There you go. Put it a little closer. There you go. Tight, tight. There you go. More rotation. There you go. Don't let this pass the belly button. Good. Corner turn. Squeeze the glutes tight. Good, same hands as the front. When the front is the back, the back is the front. So yeah, there you go. Think about like you're trying to bend a bar. There you go. Tight glutes. Squeeze them tight. There you go. Good. Hold it tight. Tight glutes. Engage your hamstrings. Tight hamstrings. Quarter turn. Good. Now try and make sure you do that, that the transition. When you, so right here is when you tighten your core. So when you turn all the way around, your art, it's, air is already out. There you go. That's it. Remember, if you can't see that arm, you're not turning from the hips. Remember, we're turning from the, from the trunk, not from the shoulder. I'm trying to bring your shoulder over. You're bringing your, you're bringing your trunk over. So you have to, it's a flexibility thing. Yeah, so it's, you're twisting this. Feel the, the, the front glute. Tight, yeah, tight. That's gonna hold you in place. Right, when you move, feel that? Yeah. Right? Now it's gonna keep you in. Now make all of them tight, tight, tight. There you go. Little bend. There you go. See a little more. I know you can't see that. That's what I wanna be. All right, I'll look straight so you can see, so you can see, you can see your shoulder, right? That's how you need to be, right? The less, the more you do this, the less wide you are. So the, all quarter turns and all poses, we wanna maintain your V taper from every angle, right? Forward, nope. Back. So this delt is going to pull this thing back, right? Delt going to pull it back. Boom. Quarter turn, face the front. Usually the transition between the quarter turns, you like to do something with the hands. Does it matter or just, just turn the ball? It doesn't, it doesn't matter. The big thing is getting into your pose fast because once, you're, once you start retracting or contracting muscle, blood starts to get in the muscle starts to grow. Right, so if you're kind of doing the transition stuff and your other boy is already in this pose, right? Everything about when you train, when you train biceps, you know, what's what's a bigger pump? The first curl or the last curl? The last one. Exactly, so think about like if I get into here, I'm not doing, I'm doing a static hold, but I'm still doing little tiny contractions. Oh, so the, so the, it, the bigger. Right, so the next pose on every one I'm doing, I'm getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So if we're doing all this extravagant stuff, it's fine to do it, I used to, from here, here, in my pose. So like you're Back. Like, you're like contracting everything at the same time. Here, up, in front, right in my pose right away. Right. Right, I'm always in it quick with transitions. Right, so it looks like I'm fluently going into it. So again, front double. Okay. Push his foot back a tiny bit. Back. No, no. Oh. Have it like right the yeah. So think about the knuckle. Uh -huh. So when I do it from here, uh -huh. right? It's not out here. It's not in the front. It's not back. If, it's, if I was here, I'm just switch, and it's right here. So if you, if I'm on this like, line, if you think of here, if I'm here, front double bicep. See how much I changed? So watch my feet, watch my toes on the line. Right, this is where I'm not, front relax, front double bicep. Right, and not much. <clears throat> yeah. Go. Okay, really good. Now think about this being tight from here. Right, so we're always trying to get this right from here. So when I'm here, if I'm up, it's always, it's always pulling this down and lengthening it, right? Oh, because the longer you can make this 
Exactly. Exactly. All right? Good. Flex hard. There. Good. Side chest. So get your feet in first. So good. Get your like. Don't don't do all this stuff with your arms until you're. So I'm gonna go. If I'm gonna be from here in the front, relax. I mean, you know, bicep here and the side chest. Right. I'm. My feet are set, and then, right? Because that's what they're looking. Their eyes are going from here up. Right. So if you're kind of already in it, this leg is not placed yet. So from here, I'm flexing. Set the ground first. Okay, so focus on that. Focus, focus, pose from the ground up. Always from the ground up. Tight, get the place, there you go. Good. Now don't try and arch your back like this. It's a quarter turn still. Right, my quarter turn's here, same thing. Good. Now scoop his chest more next time. So when you do this, so basically this arm here, you're scooping this chest scooping it in here so when we pull in you're kind of using your bicep and your chest to kind of poke this chest up higher then yeah there you go let the shoulder roll back and down there you go good pushing the glutes there you go good face it back back double bicep Yeah, good, really good. Flex here more. There you go, right? Tight glutes. All right, you should feel here, to here, to here, up. Continuing there, good. Not too much, not too much. You'll lose the shadow. So there you go, set, there you go. Now pull the air out of your stomach, you go. now it's tighter. All right, the tighter this gets, the more this comes out. Good, hamstrings, tight hamstrings. There you go, good, hold that. Hold it tight, blow the air out. There. Good. Face the front. Well, I've never seen that before. The Christmas tree. <laughs> right? Back double. Face the front, thigh abdominal. So remember, place that here. I would put it, right? We can, and remember, we're doing, like, do you, do you take any guys do martial arts? Uh, Jiu Jitsu. Oh. That's not, it's like, not like Traders. <laughs> so we're, so one is like, I took karate, so like cat stance, you're like this. So you're basically doing the same thing. I want to keep this back still so I can get my hip flexor and all the way on my quad engaged. Most times people do this and it gets flat and they lose all of this. So you want to be back, right? See that? And so you're probably going to feel again? Yeah, exactly. And then reach up and blow arrows. There you go. Good. Good. Take a pose. So one thing I do and don't like about this pose okay. is it doesn't help as much. Put it this way, your front double bicep looks way better than that pose. Okay, so then you're saying I should probably showcase a strength that I wasn't able to showcase. Yeah. Maybe like a side tricep then. Like, or some, the tricep is not a classic pose, it's a tricep. Oh, it's like a so I feel like your, your front, like your, your, your strength is your small waist and wide shoulders. This is anything this, this, uh, this, right? Anything like this is gonna look really good. This is kind of like makes you like takes away a lot. You're only showing half of your body. Put that in a routine. Right. Right. right? But like when I, as I, I, cause I, I'm a judge instead of a judge, I hate seeing this. I hate seeing guys do this. I'm seeing half you torqued while everybody else is staying in front. You're just, you're, what you're saying is there's, there's the more bang for your buck pose. hundred percent. Right. So like for you, you said for me, my smaller waist, wider shoulders, like something where like yeah, that's cla that looks classic. You can do a bunch of them. You can sit here and be like from here, um, you know, here and then right and then we're right and then boom there you go and you have a bunch of different poses from one thing don't do that one no because just again now all these kind of don't really help oh okay so keep it right those are yeah those, those are routine poses keep all those three routines oh, okay. those are great routine poses okay. for like your favorite pose if you can bang out like one or two really good ones right if you're here like this 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 thing here is like nine different poses. I learned on, on a, a look at a trophy of mine. So I learned how to pose. Show me from the feet up. So from the feet up, it's yeah. this, right? You're here, and this pose is this, it's this, it's this, it's this, right? It's this, it's also this, right? 
And then it's also this. So from, from one stand from here, and learn to do it on both sides. So learn how to do it on both sides. I remember you told me when I first tried, you said my, this foot was too turned in. You want it always. Yeah, so if you, look at, if you look at my shape, my quad, like where my quads are, most people only do this, they're either too much this or they're this. And it fucking throws everything. And this looks so stupid, right? Your back, so from the, from the waist up, yeah. same as your front. Like a, it's the exact same. No, no, so from your waist up. So from here up, uh -huh. your upper body is the same as your if you're facing the front. The only difference is, is your glutes are turned the other way. Your posterior pelvic tilt. So your glutes are, so basically when you're facing, your butt's going away from the judge all the time. Think of that. Oh, okay. So if my, from here, my hips are going this way, right? From my butt, remember, my butt's gonna go this way because the judge is this way, right? I've turned this way, my, my butt's gonna go away from the judges, right? And you want it's, it's just, you want to have this flare up so you can see everything. It's not, Everyone gets this, they want to uh, do yeah. this. You want yeah. here. I was getting in the habit, of, that's why when I was asking you, I was getting in the habit of like sitting back because I thought that would accentuate no. like this. No, because that just crams this up, right? If I, if I engage my glutes, I want to see this all build up from the bone. What about the terrors up here? Should I squeeze that or? Just... 100%. Okay. But not like, but don't change the area, change everything. Why are your hands like this, right? You gotta understand that your, your shoulders, like you don't need this part of your arm at all in any of these poses. Right, so when people do this stuff, like delt activation, your delts have nothing to do with this pose. So I shouldn't even squeeze my arms? No. Oh, okay. You should, look, if I just do this, my arms are like hanging on my lats. Then I do this, but I'm not doing this. Right, remember we're, doing, we're creating shoulder depression, right? So the teres major minor attaching right to here is pulling this down. And that's what you want. That's all you look, you want a symmetrical look. I had this wrong for a long time too. I used to do this, even with like glutes this way, I used to go, I bend him back like this, which you don't want. You just want here, so you can see everything, right? Plus you fuck up with the lighting when you bend all the way this way, yeah. right? Right. That's, that's it. That's it. That's what you want to see. It's a back relax. I just, I just feel like I'm just opening up my back. I'm not like squeezing anything. That's good enough. Yeah, you know, like, you know, it's not that it's a back relax. It's not supposed to be like you're driving a fucking motorcycle. All right, and then watch your hands. Here. So my, my wrist shouldn't be like that, huh? It doesn't necessarily matter as long as you have intention with what you do with your hands, right? There you go. That's good. And if you blow your air out, this gets tighter. Why is that? Uh, yeah, I, I never noticed that before. Because it's attached. Oh. So it's your, it's your TVA. Oh, it kind of pulls it. Everything, everything's connected. So if you look at my back, if you look at my, my rectors, yeah. that's why me engaging from here. So if I go this, right here, this is moving right here. Yeah, intentionally. By squeezing your abs. Yeah, well, so I, so I look at it from the front. Oh, it was just like slight. Slight. Like TBA.